Hey guys, it's your boy Abraham Street and in this video I'll be talking about how building a good momentum is sorry, how building a men momentum is good for your business. Sorry about that. Um and this is what I just learned. I just finished a training and it was all about momentum. So it was it was just three step and I'm just gonna explain like what why it is good for your business and sh and shits. So I just hope you guys have a wonderful, we're having a wonderful day today and I hope this video give you a lot of value and stuff. But how building a momentum is good for a business? Well, there's three steps that he was telling me about. It was about building and engaging and then sales. So we're gonna start off with building. Um, building, okay. So you, you wanna be sticking at like a platform that you know you wanna be learning and growing. So like, I'm gonna say YouTube because YouTube is a great platform and it, that was the one they kind of use in there. So YouTube, building YouTube, so building momentum, so creating videos. At first, you're probably gonna be scared of going on videos because if you see my first video, then then that's shitty. And probably right now, even now, I believe some of my videos are shitty. But guess what? I'm still improving and I'm not really scared again on going on videos. Probably the only thing I need to worry about now is like creating value, hoping that I give you guys value, sorry. Hoping that I give you guys value and stuff and probably creating some, getting the technical part of it. So building, building a great momentum because when, when and sticking, when you're just starting out, stick it, stick to one platform. Um, so you can't be, you say if it's YouTube, you're gonna use like YouTube, like organic, traffic and then you, you youtube pay traffic so stick to one platform because then then you won't kind of mess up your mind because you're gonna try to learn like say you're gonna use facebook as one and youtube as one like youtube as organic and then facebook as paid then you're gonna be confusing and trying to learn to something at once it would be best if you can be sorry it would be best if you can learn one platform and be good at it and then you try something else because that would be wiser and that would take like so take your mind out take your mind out at ease or so and that would help a great with with your momentum too because you would be won't be running up and down because when you're stressing out or creating a video you're probably gonna say shit mate let me just go create an ad because i don't like nobody's gonna see my face or anything so forget the drift so building building a great momentum and I was I'm gonna say YouTube is a great platform a pretty great platform and I would say it would be the best to start out with as you can see my channel is slowly but surely it's growing up so building momentum I just need to be be focused and be consistent on my videos and so like in anything you're doing you have to be consistently so that's a part of a great momentum too, a good momentum. And they use, they actually kind of use, um, uh, just give me a great example, like in the training, I'm just gonna give you the guy. Um, say that, I'm just gonna give it to you guys. I'm um, saying that your car broke down on the road and then you gotta push it to the sidewalk. When you just start in pushing the car, um, it's gonna be hard to move, right? It's gonna be pretty, really hard to move. Probably you and someone, you and another person or other two person, it's gonna be hard to move. But actually, after the ball start be rolling, so the cars are moving, it's gonna be easier. You're not gonna be stressing out and pushing. So you probably are, probably can use one finger and pushing it when the cars are moved. So that's building, a, that's a momentum there. Because at the first off, it will be rough and stuff, but once you get your you start getting your body, your mind, and your body start getting used to it, now it's gonna be just easy and slow and stuff until shit, it's not gonna be hard again. That's said thing with any platform that you're doing because when you're just starting out in anything in life, you're, 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 it's gonna be so hard for you, even playing a sports or something like that because. I, I play basketball. If you're gonna start or play basketball and training and stuff, and say you never played it before, 
So when you come, you're not gonna be the best dribbler on the court or the best shooter or stuff, but guess what, you have to practice, right? You have to practice and practice and practice and consistently be practicing and stuff. Then you're gonna be, it's gonna become easy and easy and it's gonna be flowing. So that's that's a great example of another great example of building momentum and engaging and with like if you're using YouTube engaging would be great YouTube like building and engaging would be kind of, kind of similar because engaging then when if when every time you create a video then you can probably send it out to your email list so that would be engaging with your email list or you can post it on Facebook or whatever platform to engage with your own audience so that could be engaging so but if it's a other platform then you know that you're gonna have to be gonna have to be creating content like like th things to get to, like things to get your audience at attention and stuff and stuff so to, to make the engage and want to like if you post something then you're gonna comment on whatever and then sales uh, I'm not good with the sales but sales I uh, I can say is that like when you when you master the in the, the building and the engaging then after that is the sales so you're gonna be start offering them like things that are in the same category as the building and engaging so say that you're in the make money niche then you're gonna be telling them you're selling them something there that they're gonna want because your content and what you're building building the trust and whatever about is in the same niche so that's the thing you have to be building that's why you build the momentum so they and they're and that the thing that's the thing too it's gonna build trust as well because your your I say your audience or your would be would trust you so so when you're building a momentum and it's gonna be bring trust and it's gonna make it's gonna be easier for you yes but it's gonna be easier for the other people because because guess what they're gonna say okay I know that guy and stuff because sorry if like if you didn't know me or probably you still don't know me but if someone that don't know you just come up and say hey I'm gonna sell you this or this amount of money you don't know the guy the guy doesn't explain it or you guy, you guy like he didn't you, you guys didn't you, you don't have any relationship with him you it's just some random guy and stuff you're gonna like who the hell are you like what the f like no man move you're not gonna want to give his give him your money or anything so that's the thing when you're building momentum now then you're gonna be building trust and stuff so after that you can actually say hey you know I have this product and it would be great for what you're in like say you're in the mom make money niche what like or the wealth or whatever you're in so let's say make money and you're in the make money niche and this would help you like um get more customers or get whatever or help you this is a strategy to help you make more money faster or something and that then you're gonna know say okay yes because I have watched content from this guy I've engaged with him I've engaged with him and stuff so I, I actually trust this guy a lot so that's the thing about building momentum and it's and as I said it was it's great for you as well because guess what it's gonna take off the load so at first it's gonna be hard and then it's gonna take time going easy and easy and easy so the ball is gonna roll um, like my videos at first it's kind of still hard for me but because I'm working and stuff and I'm not being consistent even though I want to but I can be pressuring myself I'm taking taking the time so at least three times a week that's the least or if not if not five times for our all seven days so that's what I want to do so but if it can't go all seven days it's three times a week no less than three times a week and that's what I'm doing right now so building momentum let's start just starting building and 
get you guys and then engaging with you so i'm just building my audience right now so right now one thing i'm focusing on is youtube i probably could post quotes and every time i create a video i share the link on facebook and instagram and stuff but all the thing i do on there is post quotes that's the only thing but right now it's just my youtube so building momentum make building my youtube subscribers and engaging with people on youtube and stuff giving more value and stuff you understand so yeah. when you're building momentum you have to give value the person have to be interested in what you're offering so i'm just i just want to build this right now i'm just building my youtube channel and stuff so, to be honest guys my head is hurting me because i went out and have some fun today because i love i love traveling and so i went to a river in the west Milan and it was ama amazing so i just wanted to create this video and help you guys out in it before i went to sleep and stuff as i work early in the morning so i hope you guys enjoy this video and i hope you guys get value from this video so please don't forget to like and share and leave your comment about this video right below this peace